Good morning there, Murray's readers and leaders. This is Arthur Roy Murray for Books for the Inquisitive Mind. This week I have a mystery for you. It's called Murder in the Maple. It's a wicked, wick mystery. Why is it a wicked, wick mystery? Well, Paloma and Lee own the Wicked Wick Boutique. In the boutique, Paloma, she makes... Uh, candles, scented candles. People love her scented candles. And they got trinkets. Uh, Lee is the uh, business manager, so to speak. She writes everything down. And these two do sleuthing. <laughs> That's, as part of their job, uh, uh, Lee keeps on finding dead bodies. And in this case, uh, Adam who's repairing the maple factory that was defunct. It has been working for a number of years. He's taken it over. He wants to make it into a B&B. &B. He's got all imagination, whatever. And in a problem with the dog, a wall gets hit. The wall gets open and there's a dead body and everybody goes crazy. It's a skeleton. They don't know how long at all, and uh, Paloma's ex is the sheriff, the characters are nice, the mystery, it, it moves along well, uh, the girls do their job, they investigate on the side of the, the sheriff who's got other problems, he's got fires all over the place, so he's running all over the place, so uh, his ex-wife gets involved, Paloma. And they do the investigation. They talk to everybody. They know everybody. It's an interesting one. Uh, I enjoyed it. I say that too often, but I did enjoy it. Uh, this one you should get. I don't know if you want to read all the Wicked Wick mysteries, but this, one, this book here, this one here, there it is right there. It's a good book. See you later, alligator.